uh, we originally talked to the Baron. Now we're uh, hearing Siri's side of the story and we're playing a Siri. So we jumped into this, um, save this girl Gretka from Wolves. Her home. And I believe we end up dealing with the King of Wolves. So this, if you caught the tail end of the last stream, yeah, it's the Trail of Treats. You heard that mentioned. So this connects into the which is a broke back bog, which, you know, you follow the trail of treats and it takes you to the crones and they grant you wishes or however it were. So we're gonna continue on here, get Gretka home and fight, fight, fight. Quick! Hide! <laughs> Do a lot more. Come. Did you hear that Siri reference, Look. girl? There's something there. Wait here. Don't come any closer. But no buts. Stay here. I must see something. Still moist. He died recently. Lips parted and bloated. Bit clear through his tongue. Immense pain before death. Ah, his chest is crushed. Ribs probably pierced his lungs. Something picked him up and threw him against the tree. his leg off. No, gnawed it off. Ew, that's horrible. Stay there and look away. Hmm, <laughs> what's this? Marrow's missing. Interesting. Let's see. <gasps> his liver's gone. Why are you digging through his belly? Would you mind making certain your laces are tied? Wolf King's no fantasy, it seems. Except, he's a werewolf. What happened to him? He... had a fall. Mm, I bet. The Wolf King got him. What? What we do when the Wolf King finds us? Good question. I've no silver. But I can make a blade oil. Oil? You mean like we make from rapeseed? No. A far more special oil. Of dog tallow, wolf's bane, fool's parsley, and wolf's liver. The Wolf King will feel terrible, terrible pain. You're smart. How do you know these things? Did your father teach you? Not my father. My uncle. Uncle Vesemir. Sure, pick up on all the stuff I may need. Okay, can we? 
is all in blood. Clawed open. No wolves did this. spot where I can build a fire and brew the oil in peace. What you doing? Greasing my blade. There. We'll see just how effective Uncle Vesemir's formulae are. Often send their children out to follow the sweets. Sometimes they send their children. Sometimes they go themselves. Do they return? No. Why would they? They've plenty to eat where the path ends. I'd rather be a Syrian girl, I think. Boy, you really give him a drubbing. Never seen anything like it. Girl, you can come out now. Come on. You're lucky we came this way. Found someone far less fortunate in the forest. Karen, must be. We was returning from Midcops when the brute attacked. I managed to flee, but Yaren me. The little one. No details. You have bandages at home. Some spirit? He laid a claw or two on me, unfortunately. Well, I've, I've not, miss, but my lord, he's a powerful man. He's sure to help you. Might even reward you for cutting the werewolf down. Very well. Lead us to your lord.
enter the bloody baron. Just who do you think you brought me, man? That's not me daughter. And the little one? Neither, damn it! I think I'd know my own child. Well, it uh, might, might not be yours, the older one, but you've got to admit the likeness. That's downright striking. So, any chance for that reward? You'll not see one fucking copper. Get out before I set my hounds on you. So, stew any good? Very. Thank you. I'd not eaten in... Clear to see. I'm pleased you like it. Had them prepare a bath for you, once you've eaten. And you could do with some sleep. Great care in the nook behind the hearth. You in the guest room opposite the kitchen. Thank you. I... Shh! Eat now. We'll speak once you've rested. So I ordered my men to watch her, and left her to rest. And? Ah, a topic for another time. The little girl who showed up here with Siri, what happened to her? Retka. She's safe and sound. Helps out in the kitchen. Siri told me of the girl's parents, what they decided. So I decided not to send the lass home. She's fed here. A roof over a warm corner she calls her own. She wants for nothing. What happened to Siri? I've told you already. A topic for another time. I want... I need to find her. Understand? I need every last bit of information available. I understand. But you see, it so happens my wife and daughter are missing as well. I propose an exchange. Find my loved ones, and I shall tell you about the girl you seek. All I know. Thing is, can I trust you? What guarantees do I have? <laughs> None whatsoever. Only my word. Yeah, you won't be stubborn. Fine. I'll help you. I'll find your family. But then you'll give me every bit of information you have. You have my word. God! This man's under my protection. No one's to bother him in any way. Don't stare. I've not grown horns. Treat it as a token of my good faith. When do you see them last? They vanished after the new moon, as if whisked away by shadows. What do you mean, vanished? Precisely that. I awoke one morn to find them gone. You try to search for them? Sent men out right away, but they're not suited to it. It's one thing to rip up floorboards in search of a peasant's last sack of grain. Finding a living person, they just don't know how. Besides... Velen's naught but swamps and marshy woodland. Plenty of hard to find nooks. If you're looking to hide someone, this is the place. This place must be hard to be the only two women here. This place? What do you mean? They wanted for nothing here. Pheasant for dinner? Not a problem. Blue ribbons from Toussaint? Say the word. Had your men in mind. Their company. Sure your wife and daughter weren't being harassed? My men are a horde of horsons, but they know their place. One of them so much as looked at Anna or Tamara crosswise, I'd cut him down like a dog. Anything unusual happened before they disappeared? They act differently, do anything strange? Unusual? No. Well, not long ago, peasants came to complain that a beast had ravaged a woman by the well, devoured another lass before her. Common occurrence. Anna, quiet as a mouse as ever, and Tamara, occupied with her 
things. Nothing unusual. Maybe they were kidnapped. Got any enemies? None worth mentioning. Worthless little pricks and angry peasants is all. None would dare raise a finger against my family. Any you might have? They've been eating dirt long since. I'll need to know a lot more than that. Can I see their rooms? What for? I need clues. Anything to latch on to. I'll not let a stranger pour through their belongings. Want me to find them or not? I do. Then let me work. <sighs> Fine. But I shall go with you. The doors are locked. All right, guys, that's a wrap for a series story. Um, so we'll continue on with uh, helping out the Bloody Baron here and getting some more information, maybe where she's headed to next. Um, I may stream some more of this later, but we'll pick up here next time. So PCT Grappler signing off, and I hope you enjoy and come back for more. See you next time.